Hi, everyone. Our story today comes from the book of John, chapter 11. In this story, Jesus was with his friends when he heard that his friend Lazarus was very, very sick. But Jesus told his disciples that Lazarus' sickness would not end in death. Instead, even though Lazarus was sick, God would be glorified through it. A few days later, they got news that he died. So Jesus, along with his disciples, went to the town of Bethany where Lazarus used to live. When they got there, Lazarus had already been dead in his tomb for four days. That's where they put the bodies of people after they died. Lazarus had two sisters named Martha and Mary. When they heard Jesus was coming, Martha went out to meet him and said, Jesus, if you had been here, Lazarus wouldn't have died. And Jesus said to her, I am the resurrection and the life. The one who believes in me will live even though they die. And whoever lives by believing in me will never die. Then Jesus sent for Mary. When Mary came to Jesus, she fell to his feet crying and she told him the same thing. Jesus, if you had been here, Lazarus would not have died. And Jesus cried with her because he loved Lazarus too. Jesus asked them to take him to the tomb where Lazarus lay. In those days, a tomb would have a stone door blocking the entrance to the cave where the body was kept. When he arrived, the whole town was there. Jesus told the people to take the stone away. But Martha said, Jesus, he's been in there for four days. It probably stinks. But they did it. And as they removed the stone, he prayed to God in heaven and said, Father, thank you for hearing me. In a loud voice, he said, Lazarus, come out. And Lazarus came out of the cave alive. He was still wrapped in cloths like a mummy, but he was alive and well. Everyone was amazed. Jesus told them to take the grave clothes off of Lazarus and let him go. This story shows us that Jesus is more powerful than death. Lazarus got sick and died, but Jesus brought Lazarus back to life in front of the whole town. Only Jesus, the Son of God, has the power to bring people back to life. Death is a scary thing, but for those who believe in Jesus, we don't need to be afraid of death. A little while after Jesus brought Lazarus back from the dead, Jesus himself died on the cross, but he didn't stay dead either. He rose from the dead in three days and conquered death forever. The great news is that when anyone believes in Jesus, they can receive the gift of eternal life. We don't have to be afraid of death anymore because after we die or when Jesus returns, we will live with him forever. Today we are making Lazarus mummies. <coughs> You can find these printables on our Zoe Kids page. There are two outlines per page, so you can make more than one. Find your favorite color and scribble all over Lazarus. It's okay if you color outside the lines. You're going to cut him out anyway. This is so that when you wrap your mummy later, you can tell where you've already wrapped. Next, take your scissors and carefully cut him out. Take your second sheet of paper and start cutting on the black lines. You can either cut thick strips, thin strips, or all the strips. You can also just ask a parent to chop up some paper for you. When you're done with your strips of linen, you can start gluing. If you're using a glue stick, it's okay to be more generous with how much you use. Place a strip over the glued area and ta-da, one done. If you're using regular glue, you just want to put some dots. Definitely not a lot. Keep going until all of Lazarus is covered. After your Lazarus mummy is dried, flip him over. Trim up all the extra strips of paper with your scissors.
You can draw funny eyes on him when you're done too, or use googly eyes. Thank you for crafting with us!